What is going on guys, Bisectatron here, bringing you today's live attack video, Town Hall 12, trying out the hybrid. I often like to get fancy uh, at Town Hall 12 especially, but no need to get fancy here. Um, we're just going to go straight at this base, uh, base with a tried and true strategy in the hybrid, and I'm going to go through the plan real quick. We'll do the attack live for you as usual. So the eagle is very exposed. That's kind of what I'm going off of. And also, I think I can get the eagle and the town hall both in a single queen charge, which is absolute money at town hall 12, town hall 13. Plan is to drop like two loons, take that out, a wizard behind, clear those three buildings. Um, drop my queen here with her healers. King going like that in a round. Um, then going to try to super wall break here. Queen will step up, clear this. I'll be able to super wall break again into that wall is the plan. Um, that air defense, I don't think it's going to cause too much trouble because the king should create a pretty good funnel, pushing the queen in. Um, if I can, I can freeze it. I have two freezes, three, uh, three rages, so quite a bit to keep the queen up. I'll probably end up freezing the CC on top of some of these expos at some point. And then the idea is she'll get the town hall eventually. But before that even needs to happen, I can already start, you know, like a wizard, siege barracks to kind of go like that with some hogs coming out eventually. And then just kind of come in with the hybrid right there. Two heal spells plus the warden. Um, not a whole lot for them to get through in terms of defenses. There are the heroes there, which will be kind of encountered probably by maybe my queen a little bit for the defensive queen, but the hybrid will come through as well. Um, so the, the hope is just to keep my queen, you know, get her going the right way, then keep her up um, long enough for the hybrid to come through and help her out, pushing her towards the town hall, then they'll just wrap around and finish off everything else. That's the plan. Um, pretty straightforward stuff. So let's hop into Clash of Clans, give it a try. I'm not doing too well this war, but the clan is doing very well. Um, you guys will see what I mean in just a moment. 24 for 34. Um, our opponent's doing, you know, well, uh, pretty well. Also, um, they're at about, they're at exactly two thirds. We're at, I think, slightly above two thirds. So, keep it going here, hopefully. And um, yeah, only two town hall twelves left, and then everything else is just going to be on these thirteens, uh, of which my thirteen is in this war. So hopefully, I can uh, show up at that as well. Okay, looks like I got everything. Um, Fortunately, there's a lot of people in line waiting to hit as well, I assume, so uh, not as much pressure as there might normally be, but also, you know, want to keep the the high percent uh, hit rate going. So, one last time, loons with the wizard. If a Tesla popped, I'll drop an extra loon or two. Queen, um, just enough healers to kind of keep her going. Then king on the builder hut. Um... And then we're just going from there, making sure the charge works, which I think it will. In we go. Okay. Let's start with the two balloons. One, two. No Tesla has popped, which is good. Okay, queen. One, two. of the healers on her, balloon, everything's looking good, put another wizard down there, super wall breaker, rage, balloon, king's ability, everything looking good, queen is exactly where she needs to be, Freeze the warden. That might not have been actually that was a good idea. It saved the ability, I think. Siege barracks wizard. Have to hit her ability for better or worse there. Okay, let's start the hybrid.
Oh, the queen died. I was worried that would happen. Now with that town hall up, it's going to be tough. Uh, we might want to save the warden's ability as long as we can here. Yeah, this isn't going to be good. It's going to be very difficult um, to get that town hall down. The miners can survive a shot. Um, so we can go ahead and use our last heal spell there. Just keep these miners up. I've um, got a balloon too. And we're going to get ready. Hit it right like that. That was actually a good Warden's ability, you know. Say what you will about the rest of this attack, but... Ooh, that was a good Spring Trap. Well placed. Yeah, if the Queen had stayed up, and this definitely would have tripled, I would say. Um, yeah, it's too bad. <sighs> a little Warden walk to end the attack. Yeah, I mean, it was tough. There was definitely a lot on the Queen, and I did my best to kind of manage the spells. Seeking Aramine hit one of the healers. I was trying to avoid that, but um, just couldn't slip those balloons in properly. Yeah, I mean, that'll do it. If anything, it, you know, maybe if I had one less heal and the extra rage it actually would have helped me. I mean, it's very rare you see four rages and two freezes for a single queen charge, but, you know, this was the charge of all charges. So, um, perhaps that was the play. I think the plan overall wasn't bad, and maybe it can be... Uh, redone. We'll go ahead and take a look at the replay, see what happened um, exactly. Fast forward to the start here. Funnel was good on both sides, I would say. So the start of the queen charge, everything went well. Um, super wall breakers did their job opening everything up. First few balloons. Actually, I did trip one seeking your mind, so I will, you know, that I will say that was worth it there. Go times one here as this queen charge starts to develop. Um, the Warden does a lot of damage, you know, even only level 40, it's still a high level, does quite a bit of damage, and he's just beating on the Queen, so that freeze was good, because right here, I'm pretty sure she would have popped her ability, the problem was, the Air Sweeper starts to push back those healers, and they just can't keep up, right here, I knew it was coming, you know, maybe I actually could have waited a little bit on that ability, I mean, I do have the automatic ability, maybe I should just let it happen, I have a tendency to hit it, you know, a little earlier when I think the timing is better, but in this case, maybe if I could have saved that a little bit, because um, right here, and also if I had started the hybrid a little earlier, because the queen came back for some reason, a miner that she was targeting died, right here, if that doesn't happen, you know, I guess she's on a wall, maybe she wouldn't have survived that anyway, but it certainly didn't help having her um, have to deal with the queen as well. Just the town hall, that archer tower would have gone down pretty quickly. Um, it looks like once either the hybrid or the queen got it. So she might have been able to just hold on long enough to get the town hall had that not been the case. Um, would have allowed me to you know, use this warden's ability a little earlier. Honestly, if I knew that Tesla farm was there, I would have brought all Valkyries. Um, the reason I brought one Valkyrie was to kind of help take out some of the trash and trigger some giant bombs, perhaps, as the hogs kind of moved along defenses. But, um, you know, the Valks are not bad in the siege barracks to kind of come out and clear stuff if they're being used to funnel a hybrid attack. But in this case, um, hit a few spring traps, which definitely hurt. Uh, I think I lost six miners just in like this 10 second period as they hit another well-placed spring. I will give the uh, the base builder that. It was a well-placed spring. So that's tough. Um, not doing too well myself, but the clan's doing well. And hopefully we can finish off these last few Town Hall 12 bases and then get it going at Town Hall 13. You guys will probably see some highlights from this war. And last but not least, be sure to check the channel. I'm having a little bit of a sneak peek video coming out very soon on this update that's coming. So um, you guys will get to see kind of an exclusive new uh, addition to the game. So look forward to that, and I'll see you guys next time. Thanks for watching this video. If you enjoy my content, consider supporting the channel by entering my creator boost code bisect in the settings tab of your game and keep in mind it occasionally resets and must be re-entered. Click or tap for another video and be sure to subscribe. See you all next time, Bisectatron out.